Hi, it's Pete Rolls. It's Joe Fury, the Stoke Made Weather Center. It was really a very nice Wednesday across uh, Connecticut and all of southern New England, even though you still have that smoke from the Canadian wildfires. We have a cold front that has moved on through during the course of Wednesday evening, and uh, we had some rain, but nothing overly significant. And now, well, it would appear that this front will bring in a drier northwesterly wind. In other words, we should be able to clear the smoke out to the south and have a nice bright blue sky for the day tomorrow. What's interesting about tomorrow, those of you along the shoreline will actually be warmer than you've been the last few days as the wind will come off the land, not off the water. So you get to go up to 70, especially southeastern Connecticut where you've been in the low 60s. But areas in northern Connecticut that have been in the mid 70s are going to go into the mid 60s for highs. Uh, anyway, you slice it. Tomorrow is a beautiful day. A little breezy and then yeah we've had morning lows down in the, the 40s a lot during the course of this week that'll be the case again tomorrow and again friday morning a couple of 30s in the colder valleys but all eyes are on the holiday weekend and wow do we have some amazing weather for this memorial day weekend high pressure building in behind the cold front that brought some rain during wednesday evening is uh, going to dominate our weather going to keep low pressure down to our south off the southeast coast, which could become a tropical weather system. Weather conditions for the Carolina beaches, Georgia beaches, Florida, not good at all for the holiday weekend. Best weather is here. Remember back in April, everybody went south, Florida, southeast United States, looking for some great weather, and all the great weather was here. We had three days in a row in Hartford with warmer temperatures in Miami back in mid-April. Well, we're going to do it again this Memorial Day weekend. The best weather is going to be right here. Uh, so, yes, there's the setup. The high reinforcing building in as the low gets stuck to the south. 30s, uh, we'll say upper 30s to low mid 40s to start the day on Thursday. Highs in the mid 60s across northern Connecticut near 70 at the coast with a sunny breezy day with the warmest temperatures at the beaches. And again, it should be a bluer sky as the smoke gets suppressed to the south. And then 40s and a few 30s to start Friday. Highs, uh, we'll say, in the upper 60s, low mid 70s for a sunny, seasonable, fantastic Friday. And then Saturday, we're heading towards 80 inland, 70 at the coast. No denying the water temperature is 58. So if you're going to be boating on the sound, it's obviously going to be much cooler. The beach is going to be cooler over the course of the holiday weekend. You know, always probably closer to 70 at the beaches. Well, we're 80 inland Saturday in the 80s Sunday and even Memorial Day has a shot at 90 in Lynn. Uh, the bottom line is all the waterways are going to be busy this weekend. The rivers and the sound and the lakes and so forth. Just be extra careful. Remember that water is still very chilly. Look at this Sunday and parade time. Memorial Day is looking fantastic. So it's upper 30s, low mid 40s, a little breezy too as we head to through into early on on Thursday, so you're going to need a light jacket probably tomorrow. Sunny, breezy, comfortable, especially you guys in the hills. Shoreline, no, it's 70, it's sunny, it's nice, it's comfortable, uh, but the interior higher elevations are going to be just low 60s, and the sun comes up about 526, goes down around 817. Eight-day forecast, look at that, unbelievable. At the shoreline, temperatures, uh, you know, into the, we'll say Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, around or just over 70. 75 to 80 for a beach day on Memorial Day. And then to keep that 75 to 80 through the middle of next week. And uh, as far as interior goes, we're 60s Thursday, 70 Friday, mid to upper 70 Saturday, 80, or maybe the low 80s on Sunday and mid to upper 80s uh, for Memorial Day. Uh, what more can I say? It's the unofficial start of summer and it's summer in a big way. Yeah, we're raining down sunshine and uh, again, make those outdoor plans. Pollen count still high. The uh, idea for uh, the sun being extremely strong, got to make sure you're protected. Uh, but uh, for now, just be safe if you're going to be on the waterways. And we'll have you updates uh, through the rest of the week and right through this upcoming weekend to see if there are any changes. But right now, we're very confident it's going to be one of the best Memorial Day weekends we've had in a long time. All right, I hope you feel well. Bye.